A gentleman with intermediate risk prostate cancer has many options of treatment, and this is just one of them. Options include surgery and then various forms of radiation. There is external radiation, there is high dose rate radiation, which we're doing here, and there is low dose rate radiation or seed implants. And what we started doing earlier today was placing the catheters, and that's what you can see here, the little hollow things or the red things. These little catheters were placed in the OR this morning, and there's 16 of them peripherally loaded around the prostate. With this target, then the physicist goes to work in to carrying the dose of radiation I want to give to that as safely as possible. So this will be carried out um, over, uh, over about 10 minutes of treatment to build this radiation cl cloud through the catheter using that single iridium-192 or high dose rate isotope. Um, and then we'll pull out the catheters and the gentleman will go home and return two weeks later to have it done one more time and that will be the completion of their therapy, two half days and really no loss of work otherwise. There are acute side effects associated with it like urinary frequency, urgency, should be fairly minor. Um, there might be a little bit of bowel urgency, there might be a little bit of fatigue. His prognosis for this is as good as any treatment we have today for the treatment of intermediate risk prostate cancer. Our data suggests about a 95 to 98 percent cancer control rate at five years and over 90% at 15 years.